Hey, welcome back. I've got some new bits, yes. The Kanga KSMR 20, 20 watt mod. Very nice display there. And I've got the Kanga Sub Mini. Normally comes with a Sue box. I've got the black one. Now, I don't know what you think about the black one going together, but I've just, uh, instead of my aero tank, which I may uh, compare for you later, but so I haven't gone fully sub yet to the half, but. I've got this set to 12 watts. So the minimum is 10. On the guide here it says, yeah, minimum is 10. So this is for the liquids to go in the tank. To use this tank, you must prime the coils first. Uh, but there is a guide, it tells you there. Let me put that up to the screen. It comes in different languages on the other side as well. And the good thing about this mod, it's nice design. It's not, I, the square ones, I don't quite like the way they, f they fit in the hand. Um, this goes up to 20, 20 watts, which is fine for this. This Kanga sub tank goes up to uh, 50 watts. <clears throat> um, 50, 60. It could take 60 watts, <clears throat> this tank. The minimum watts for this device is 10. So I've got 20, which is double the minimum. The battery, does, the mod doesn't go any higher than that, but this will take 60. So this has got a big range. So it's a good tank. Um, I like these new coils they've come out with. These most versions I've got is the latest version one, which has got the slightly bigger holes. There. <clears throat> these are bigger than the previous one. Um, now once I've gone on this, it's hard to go back. But I'm hoping that I'll be using this generally and then when I'm out of uh, 8 Club, I'll use this. So, I have to see. But it's a nice device and it's black. It goes together with uh, the mod and the red. So I've got the red battery in there. Okay, I've just topped this up with um, watermelon, kiwi and aniseed from Mixology. And I'm just going to turn this up. Okay, so I'll tilt that. Go up to about 15. Okay. Blinding. Um, the only thing about this compared to say the square mods, which is Kanga's, Kanga's got one that goes with this, the Sue box. It does have a USB input connection which you can plug it straight into the charge and charge it and use it while it's, while it's charging. With this, obviously I've taken the battery out and then charged that separately or swap it over with a spare battery. Um, the sub box is quite good because you can use these batteries and it's a matter of swapping them over. Um, so you could charge a battery, take it out and swap, put another one in and charge, carry on charging. So the suit box is a charger in as well. Um, I looked at the, uh, if you look on my site, you'll see there's the Inakin cool fire. Now I like that, I like the metal look. Um, I tested one and it didn't seem to power, power up very well. I was using my aero tank and it just wasn't really doing a lot and then um, I tried this and it performed a lot better so even though this, the 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 uh, cool fire says it goes up to a big wattage and all this type of thing you know it just wasn't seemed to kicking it out three clicks to come out of lock then eight clicks quickly done too many Press it a couple of times, right. And now I can change, go down. Is that the right way? Yep. So I'm going to go down to seven and a half. 
or maybe eight. Kanga Tank Aero Mega. I mean, it's quite a lot of vape on that. It's actually 13 tins called Lucy. This nice, sleek mod. So that's the one I can carry about with me. And when I put the sub tank on, and the black tank, so that'll be nice. Um, I think I'll probably put the black tip on now. Now that I've got the black glass. I need to find a black battery. And then we'll all be sorted. <laughs> Okay, well, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe and uh, follow me. Other, there's some other videos in there. If you go on my website, it's all laid out clearly there. Um, all the details are on the pages with photographs. And I've also put a couple of other little videos there that will be helpful. And um, so check out my sites. I've got the link below. It's my vaping reviews. So, yeah, guys, I hope this is helpful. Any questions? Don't be afraid to put your questions in because uh, I always answer them. And um, so, yeah, happy vaping, guys. I'll take a lung hit now. Flavour's nice.